Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Assalamu alaikum. Today I am going to teach you both the methods that is BIPTEC and BIPLATEX side by side so that you may note the differences between the two reference management tools. First of all, open the text audio. Text audio is an ID for MIPTEC. Go to file. Click new. A new file will be opened. Untitled. Again go to file. Now click on save to save the file. After you click the save, this window will be opened. Now type the name of the file. Here I have typed the name of the file as references.bib. Remember that the extension of the file must be .bib. Now click on save. Again go to file. New to create a new file. Then go to file. Click on save. Write the name of the file, but this time the name of the file should be with .tex extension because this is the file where you will be writing your thesis, book or article, etc. The last file that you saved with the .bib extension was for saving your references that you will copy from Google Scholar or any other database. Click on save. Now we have created two new files one with the name of references.bib and another one with the name thesis.tx. In this file, we will save references that we will bring from Google Scholar, while this file will be used for typing research article or book, etc. Now, let me tell you the difference between BibTech and Bibliotech. Up till now, the steps for both BibTech and Bibliotech were same. Now, this is the step that will be different for BibTech and BibliTech. So let's see the difference between both. On the left side, I'm showing you the method of BibliTech, while on the right side, I'm showing the method of BibTech. So go to Bibliography, and menu will be opened. Now select Type. This menu will be opened. For writing your references in BibliTech, select BibliTech. And if you are writing your references in BibTech, then you will have to select BibTech. So this was the step that will be different for Bibliotech and BibTech. Next, go to Google Scholar to search for your desired references. Type the keyword. For example, I have typed four sentences here. Then click on search. Your desired references will appear here. Select this button that is called Cite button. This window will be opened. Then click on BibTech. This step is same for both the BibTech and Bibliotech. As soon as you click this button, the reference will be appeared here in a new window. Then select the reference. Copy the reference. Now come to Text Studio again. Click references.bib file and then paste the reference here. Similarly, repeat these steps for other references as well. Go to Google Scholar, search for the references, click on site and then BibTech and copy the reference and then paste it here in the references.bib file. After you copy all the references from Google Scholar, go to file again and save this .bib file again. Now go to your second file that is thesis.tex because here you are going to write your synopsis thesis or any research article and you are going to insert references in your document from this file so now let me show you the method of writing a sample document here and i will also show you the differences between bibtech and bibliotech method of inserting references so select this file and here I'm going to tell you the difference between BibTech and Bibliotech style of the reference management. So slash document class will be the same for both. Begin document, end document. These three things will be same in BibTech as well as in Bibliotech. Now the differences will start. In BibTech, you type slash bibliography and then type the name of the file where you have saved your references, but you do not give any .bib extension here. However, in Bibliotech, you write slash add 
bib resource and then in curly braces you type the name of the references file with extension that is dot bib then in bibdeck you write slash bibliography style to type the name of the style here while in bibliotech you will have to write slash use package and then you type the name of the style after that in curly braces you write the bib related that is the tool name that you are going to use for reference management after this you will have to write an extra command in bibliotech that is slash print bibliography and this command doesn't exist in this bibtech style however in bibliotech you must write this command to insert the bibliography at the end of the document in front of this command you can write the title of the bibliography but this command is optional here so if you do not want to type the title of the bibliography then it will give the default title to your bibliography so now the whole skeleton of your thesis is complete now you will have to write your thesis or book here after the slash begin document start typing your document both in bibtech and bibliotex you can use slash cite command and then in curly braces you give the key of the reference that you are going to insert after this statement the command for both bibtech and bibliotech is same in this case once this is complete then click these green triangles then go to tools that is this click on this once you click this this menu will be opened go to commands after commands this menu will be opened now the difference between bibtech and bibliotech is that in bibtech you select bibtech here while in bibliotech you select this biber after you click on this again click this green triangle so after clicking the green triangle you will see the result of your document this is is the inserted citation and here you will see the list of references also here in bibliotech you will see the references below your document and now some bibtech style names and bibliotech style names so thank you for watching bye